Hey guys, it's Nerf Boy Productions here, and today I'm here with an unboxing and review of the brand new um, Nerf Elite Rough Cut 2x4, or 2x4. I really think it's 2 times 4 but what does it matter? Alright, um, so this is one of the new guns from the Elite line. I just picked up all the new Elite ones they had at Toys R Us, so expect to see a lot more unboxing and reviews on all the other guns. I got the Elite Reflex, uh, the Elite Jolt and the Elite Fire Strike as well as the Rough Cut. And that's actually all I had, but anyway, on to the video. Uh, this thing shoots 22 meters, or it's advertised to. Uh, that also equals out to about 75 feet. Um, so yeah, um, right here what I wanted to mention was, it um, on the box, it says, it's got a little serial number. It says, a1691. I don't know if that's uh, just something random on the box. I don't know what that is. But what I'm wondering if that's a serial number. If that's a serial number, that's kind of cool. If each gun has its own specific serial number. I know all guns do, but it's kind of cool that they would include that on the box. That means they're not just printing the same design every time. It's actually different. Um, Alright, so on the back gives us some elite features. We have the tactical rail, a little thing telling us about the tactical rail, uh, a thing telling us about the prompt action slam fire handle thingy, and uh, yeah. So, if you know, this gun is like the multi shot madness. It shoots two at once, um, or just one at a time. Really, it's kind of cool. But uh, let's go ahead and unbox this, because people have told me I talk too much. So, um, yeah, if people are coming to see videos of me unboxing this, I'm pretty sure they know what this is I'm unboxing. So let's get right in here. My new, I just bought a new X-Acto blade for my knife, so it's much sharper than my old one, which is very nice. Alright, so... One thing I can probably tell about this gun, it's very light. Alright, so let's pull it out now. Alright, very cool. And, uh, box is now empty. Put that to the side, and let's take a look at this. Of course, we get quick start guide, which may be necessary to use, um, just to operate this gun because it's a little different from anything we've seen before. It's it's even different than the barrel break. Um, then of course, uh, if we just cut this. Um, yeah, okay. Let's just... Uh, that. Sorry about this. I really don't want to scratch the paint on this gun. Alright, there's the... Oh, man, this gun. It's pretty awesome. Um, and then... We have our elite darts to get eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cool. And uh yeah, so that's awesome. Oh my gosh. Um that's pretty much it for the unboxing part of the Elite Rough Cut 2x4. That's pretty much what you get with it. Just the gun like normal, the darts like normal, and the manual like normal. Yeah, not much to it because there's no clip, because the clip's built in. Anyway, on to the review segment of this video. Alright, so I've got an awesome chance to uh, play around with the gun, and I have to say it's great. Um, let's go over what the gun looks like. So, let's just... Alright, pretty cool. It's got the nerf, and strike elite, and strike elite. Um, of course, the eight darts go in the front. Looks kind of like that, like honeycomb. Looks kind of like, uh, so, says rough cut, two times four. 
other side is exactly identical. Uh, they didn't do that paint thing on the uh, where on the strife they only painted like one side of that and the other side was just black. They did both sides, which is cool. Um, so yeah, now on to the features of the gun. It's got the one. It's got the bandolier on there, so you can have it like um, hanging on a strap and just underarm, or you can have it on the on your belt, which is cool. And then you can like sling it up and just. Um, so that's cool as well. Uh, it's got one tactical rail on the top. So I wouldn't use it, uh, any attachments on a shotgun. It does have it, which is nice. It's got the built-in, doesn't move, plastic, little plastic sight, which is cool. Well, not really cool, but it's there. <laughs> a lot of stuff that's there that's not needed. Um, it's got the trigger, which I'll talk about more later, um, how it functions and stuff. It's got the priming handle, which is very cool. Um, so yeah, now let's uh, go on to how the gun works. So basically you push in your darts, your eight darts, and then you prime it. Alright, so you prime it back, and then forwards, basic gun. And then just like a barrel break, if you pull the trigger halfway, you shoot one. If you pull it all the way, you shoot two. So here's uh, one shot. Here's the second shot. Yeah, so one thing to note is if you pulled one shot and then you keep pulling to pull the second one, you have to pull really hard. So there. Yeah, you have to pull really hard. But basically, what you need to do is you need to go forwards, then back, then forwards. It's very iffy. Uh, I've seen a lot of other videos just to see if I wanted the barrel break. Or not the barrel break, the uh, rough cut. And, pe yeah, people are saying that they are, the triggers are um, not the best, which is not nice to hear. But apparently that's what they're saying. Um, and they're right. Another thing, the priming handle is very small. It can uh, just, like, it can just fit my pinky finger, well, especially when I do that, like, it's very tight, and then my thumb has to come around and hold it like that, which isn't a problem, but it's, it's, like, it's not even going on all the way, it's, um, you know, it's not really working for me, <laughs> but, uh, other than that, the gun is absolutely awesome, um, even though it doesn't take clip fed, which it shouldn't if it's a shotgun, it's very cool. I can just like put in eight darts um, and just shoot eight rounds like a normal shotgun, which I think is pretty cool. It makes it more authentic, um, as authentic as a Nerf gun can be. And one more thing is that when you're shooting, if you shoot both uh, at the same time, you're going to get the top two first, then those ones and those ones and those ones. If you're going to shoot single, you're going like boom, 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 boom. Actually, I'm not sure. Yeah, alright, so you're getting boom, 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 boom. Alright, so starting with that one. I guess it doesn't really matter, but. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it for the review of this gun. Um, yeah, so. Very cool. Now. Let's shoot it off. Alright, so uh, one thing I need to mention is when firing the rough cut with darts, um, a lot of those issues I was talking about don't exist. The trigger pull is great with the darts in, because when you push them in, uh, the barrels click, and that like activates the barrels and makes them more functional somehow, but they work better with darts in. Surprise, surprise. Um, so yeah. Very cool. Of course, we're just going to be firing in our normal firing area and yeah so that's a zoomed in shot it was about 30 feet away this is not a range test just a firing test can't do a range test indoors unless you have a really big house or something but let's uh, shoot some rounds alright so we're gonna start off just single single uh, pump we're just gonna shoot two darts at once just in this general area Normally I aim at the tin disc, I guess I'll take the first shot at the tin disc. But, um, yeah, so here goes the uh, first shot. Trying to fire both darts at once. Here we go. 
So that's amazing. I'm just going to keep doing that. And that was eight darts right there. Um, they go crazy. That might just be the darts it came with because those were the exact darts it came with. Never been fired. I actually just fired those for the first time. And they went and like spread which like a shotgun, which is kind of cool, but also kind of annoying. So now I'm going to fire it with my other darts and see what that's like. And I'll also be doing single shot. Here we go. Now let's quickly fire off some uh, some uh, slam fire action, just because I want to show you guys everything this gun can do from single shot, which I wouldn't recommend ever, even with a uh, with a barrel break or a rough cut. I can I find it kind of funny how they actually even give you the option of doing single shot because it's pretty stupid. You wouldn't get a barrel break, like a double shot gun. You wouldn't buy one to use single shot. You'd use it for double shot, multi shot madness, blah, blah, blah. Same with a rough cut. You buy it for the, not the little one shot. So, um, I don't really care that, some of you might, but I don't care if my single shot isn't very good, because I would only use this for spamming. But um, now let's do, hold down the trigger and uh, fire off six more darts because I just accidentally shot two. <laughs> All right, um, so yeah, let's fire off six darts really fast. Here we go. So that wasn't very fast, but the gun can shoot very fast. That's it for the rough cut. I was really hoping I'd be more impressed with it. Um, I love it, but it does have some faults. Uh, Nerf really needs to work on that. Anyway, that's it for my review, guys and unboxing. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. As always, this is Nerf Productions, signing out.